This one's going to be on Blogilo. It's basically a uh, desktop client to, you know, post your blogs. Uh, last time I used this, it was called Bilbo, but I guess since then they got sued by uh, the Lord of the Ring guys for using the word Bilbo. Anyways, uh, they changed their name. So what you can do with this program, uh, first thing you want to do is add your blog in. So that's what we're going to do. Let me fill out my information. Do After that, uh, you just hit the auto configure, and that's it. You hit OK, and you should have your blog uh, logged in here. And this is all my old posts. You see, because I logged it in. If you actually want to edit this, you can do that. Let's say I click on this, and you can see that. Uh, let me um, maximize this here, so you can see that you can actually edit uh, all your old posts from here if you like. All right. Uh, what else do they have in here? So they have these other uh, categories here on your toolbox. Okay, so these are uh, I guess for for your tags and the post option. Whether you want comments or not, uh, it's up to you. And there's local entries here. I'll give you an example of this. So let's say we do a new post. Okay, it's just blank here. Let's give it a title. I don't know. I'll put you test run something and then we type in something ha 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 that's it um, what else can you do oh you can actually use well this is the WYSIWYG editor or the visual editor they call it uh, if you want to do HTML they have it here too and the post preview okay so now we have our title and this is the body here that you, you type in whatever content you want Right here, they have this thing called, uh, you know, the the post previous uh, body style here, um, or the blog style. Being, um, basically, if you want to see how it looks like, now this is only works if you connect it to the internet. Okay, so if I grab the style from my blog, uh, I'll give you a preview of it, how it looked like, or something like this, right? Uh, if you want to disable that, just uncheck this box and we're back to what we were. But if we save it locally, right, let's say you wrote your blog, all that, but you don't want to submit it yet, you can actually just save it locally and it will be saved in this uh, local entries here with all the other ones. Okay. All right. And whenever you want to submit it, you just hit the submit button here and, and that's it. You're off and you're good to go. Uh, I think that's about it for what you can do in here. They do have all the basic stuff whether you want to, I don't know, is this uh, increase the size and maybe add images. If you have images on your computer you can do that. Let's give it an example here. Um, where's my pictures? Oops. Maybe that one? What is this one? <coughs> Alright, something like that, right? Open a picture. Um, other things you might want to do in here. Let's see, upload media. I think this is for videos or something. Oh, another thing that you, you probably want to do is. Uh, you go to configure Blogilo and you want to go to editor here and enable spell checking because that's not enabled by default um, you know you want to be professional I guess um, other things or if you want to ever delete your account uh, from auto you know logging in when you're using this program uh, just go in here and then just hit remove and you won't be connected to that blog anymore that's basically it though so play around with that if you need a blogging tool from your desktop um, but only recommend this if you're on KDE though because it's mainly you know made for KDE but that's it for this program